Sudbury is a very significant mining complex in the world. There are 21 teams from 14 different companies. So this is a great opportunity for, for our mine rescue teams to meet with others and, and learn from best practices of the other teams. In order to be able to make change, make improvement, it, you have to bring all the people together. Not only the, the sponsors, but the countries that are participating and, and get as much knowledge exchange as possible. Yes, they're competing, but I think the camaraderie and, and the learning, best practices, uh, uh, all working together to uh, hone their craft and, and, uh, and be the best that they can be in mine rescue is uh, very important and, and they all recognize that. Competitions are an opportunity for the mine rescue volunteers to celebrate the hard work they do, the preparations they do, uh, in a in sort of a community uh, access medium, and um, really they can the, the public can can see what the, the mine rescue volunteers train to do and what they respond to in the middle of the night when there's a mining emergency. They're a tight-knit group, and so it is uh, something they take a great deal of pride in at the end of the day. Uh, the objective is to make sure that the miner comes out uh, alive and can return home to their families. If there's a failure, it ends in tragedy sort of thing. So the, the teams have to be exceptionally good at what they do. So that, that's why it's so important, not only for the teams, but uh, the community as a whole. Good. Yeah. Good challenge. Good workout, that's for sure. I haven't felt better. Well, I made it to surface and I guess I'm going to make it, so it was a good day. Mine rescuers are a, uh, a, a style or a breed of personnel onto themselves and they're very committed to their, their craft. And what you see here at this competition are the, the best of the world coming together to demonstrate and showcase their skills. exceptionally excited and honoured to take part in this great competition. In the past few days, we believe that we have undertaken what we are made of. unique about underground miners in that uh, they have a strong desire to assist in the event of an emergency. They want to know that they're able to help 
when something goes wrong underground. Uh, it's that desire that, that drives them to become a part of Mine Rescue, to train and to continue training. We have men and women that are willing to put their, their life on the line to help uh, a mother or a father come home to their family at night. things go wrong on a mine site, um, these are the people that I rely on to go get those miners when something goes wrong. Um, they study hard, they home in their skills, they learn the procedures, uh, and they're the people we rely on when things go bad. Mm -hmm.